God. I would recommend this for people that are still in high school. Totally. Oh yeah, this is this is for the for the Teen the tweens, for the tweens, for the early age age kids, thirteen. I'd say twelve to fifteen. Yep. Maybe sixteen. Once upon a pair of sneakers, there lived a boy who was full of creativity. You believe that sneakers are a window to the soul. If you put enough of yourself into a design, it's gonna hit. Once I slip on that sneaker, it's my story. No. Uh, possibility and opportunity can feel as far away as a castle in the clouds. Yes, Seeker royalty. Designed for the king brand? That's my dream. We need to dominate. Seeker con. We need something big. We need a new voice. Someone fresh. Find a designer that speaks to you, tells a story. We'll try it out. Now we just gotta find him. You are very talented. I just scribbled my notebook. I'm a stock boy. I think I hear your stepfather talking. This is the real world, not some doodle or some nonsense you're dreaming about. <laughs> and clean that up too, hell. What the fuck? To his it's dreams, on Disney Plus. So the there's going to be a lot of the King's family drama in this. Six kicks. There's not enough time for that. Lace up. Come on, you've got sneakers to make. Lace it up. Kicks. 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 Making shoes, saving the world. You put in the work, huh? You're ready for the big night then. What? I don't do it with him. He's got magic sneakers. Sorry. Whoa. Love at first sight. Did you design these? Sure, it's like Cinderella. It is. With the slippers. But it's midnight. He's got to get out. It is. Oh, my God, dude. He's got to go and he's going to lose his slippers. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm glad no, I watched this trailer because like, I had no idea where this was going. Sneakerella! <laughs> oh my god. Give me a fucking oh break. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, now I remember reading something. So Cinderella, like... The whole story, like with the animation, where Disney made the Cinderella <laughs> animation or whatever, it's based on a story that goes way, way back. So the story's in the public domain, but Disney kind of has like the first dibs on it or something because they're the ones that made the animations. Uh -huh. So every like five years, they roll out some new twist on the Cinderella Fuck. myth and the story so that they could kind of maintain it within their franchise and their wheelhouse because they don't have to pay any rights really to the original story because it's, wow. not, it's in the public domain. It is, like huh? you and me could make a Disney or make a Cinderella like rip off too, you know? Like, yeah. You know, and there's been dozens of them, of course. Yeah. But like this one was so blatant like Jesus. in a lot of ways. You and I just both blew up at the same time. We like, totally what? did. Oh my God. <laughs> God, it's just like, ugh.